All right, guys, that is an Aston Martin Vantage we're all very familiar with. But today, I want to show you something really special, and that is this one. The Aston Martin Vantage F1 Edition. Now, for those of you who watch F1, you would have known that you see a particular car that looks like this and with this amazing color running around. So today, I want to show you uh, the little differences uh, that this car has. Now, the good news is these days, whenever there is a new stock that came, somebody will snap it up. You would see it is sold. And that's why I removed my watch just in case I get near it. All right, come closer. I just want to point out this one has the blacked out badge. All right, and there is this really beautiful strip over here on top of the paint. Now, the paint work is that exact Aston Martin green that is so special. And uh, in person, it just looks amazing. It almost feels like a pearl British Racing Green. You know, British Racing Green is like a dark green, but Aston Martin, uh, which took custodian of this color now, uh, you can see that the British Racing Green solely rests on Aston Martin's uh, laurels to carry on the, uh, the pride forward, okay? So you have the glimmers that shine on top and there's a pearlescent effect to it, at, at least to my eyes. Now, what's special about this one is that it has these louvers, the carbon fiber vents on the side of the hood. As you can see, this is one of the largest single piece hood of any car, all right? And what it creates is that it creates a very beautiful look on the entire surface, which is super clean. There are no bonnet opening lines because the whole bonnet opens from here and here over the wheel arches and into the front headlamps. A very intricate design, all right? Now, down here, we have these splitters, okay? And um, of course, you can probably spec them in carbon if you want to, but this, to me, is nice enough. And I always think that having a regular material as the splitter is more practical, shall I say, than, than carbon, you know, how costly carbon is, and if you hit it, you know. And it's such a good looking car, all right? The blacked out bits, and then the wheels, these are, again, shorter in P0s. Aston's now, almost across the board, they're all shorter in P0s, some of them. And uh, down on the side here, this is very special, all right? Look at these vents, they open up like that. Very, very special, and you, you get this F1 edition batch on the side here. So this is a different Vantage, all right? Here, of course, we have some skirting on the sides here, carbon fiber side mirror covers, a carbon fiber roof, come closer. Look at the carbon fiber roof. On the middle, you have that concave surface, right? That gives it strength and airflow, but they also wrap it in this matte material, which looks really great when you combine them together. And over here, you see the green, the special British racing green color. You see the little glimmer that shimmers off it. And then you have the dark glass, you have the carbon, you have this blacked out window lines. Just looks really great over here. This is the big thing at the back here, right? This giant wing at the back. Makes me feel as though other Vantages should have a wing as well because the Vantage is Aston Martin's small, compact, darty uh, supercar that goes against the likes of a Porsche GT3, right? I mean, 535 horsepower is no slouch. 685 newton meters of torque. And the price point is like 1 million, right? That is before tax, of course. But in terms of pricing and performance, I mean, these guys are on par with the GT3s and the GT3 RS and all that. Right, and then here, over here, the Aston Martin word is decked out in black. Very nice. And then you have the clear tail lamps. Here we have the diffusers and the double tip exhaust. All very, very good looking. All right, and these are high polish. You know, recently there are a lot of GT wings where you see raw cut metal at the back and all that, but Aston choose to finish them in classy gloss black. 
paint, all right? So it's been a long time since I see a wing that choose to be elegant than outright sporty of seeing raw carbon, raw metal screws and all that, okay? So as this car is sold, we have to be ultra careful, all right? Come and have a look here. That's the interior spec of this car. The entire interior is Alcantara. This is Alcantara, Alcantara over here. This is gloss black. I like this arrow effect that shows here. And then I like this combination, it's just beautiful. Here you have really high grade leather. And then with the contrast stitching of like neon yellow or green. And then here we get a stripe that runs over here. The door handles, the contrast stitching, all very good looking, very sporty, very focused. And then the, the instrument binnacle, see this one? is also finished in Alcantara with stitching. The steering wheel, look at that. It's my first time holding a square and Alcantara Aston Martin steering wheel. All right, it's good they wrap it up because Alcantara tends to hold on to a lot of residues. All right, in the middle here, we have the same high quality leather. And then here there are bits that for your knees and all that, right, it's all finished in Alcantara. And then of course we have the F1 edition badge over there. Very nice. I'm surprised the roof liner remains cloth. I would have expected it to be, to be Alcantara as well. But of course, sometimes if you want to get your allocation quick, snap it. There's no time to specify, you know, what sort of combination you want. The seats, leather, and in the middle, Alcantara. Beautiful, beautiful spec. Fantastic. Oh, nice. So, yep, congratulations to the owner. Now, for those of you who are interested in Aston Martins, come over to Aston Martin Kuala Lumpur here, speak to them, and don't wait because these days, one comes, one's, one gets sold. The DBX, the Vantage, I, I'm seeing fewer and fewer cars. Every time I come here, they, they get changes, you know. And I'm, I'm also very thankful for Aston Martin KL for letting me come in here to always, always shoot their, their, their new arrivals, their stocks and all that. All right, so do come over here, check it out. Cheers.